What's going on everyone? Uh, so today I'm going to be showing you one of the, has got to be the most insane ramp push at least that I've come up with. Uh, it's all because of the, the whole building sensitivity thing. It's the only reason why this is even possible. Uh, so you might have seen a little bit of it in one of my last videos. And basically it's, so I'm calling it the unstoppable ramp rush, which, you know, it's stoppable. Like, you can, you can get killed doing it, but it's got to be the safest one. Like, someone could probably RPG me down doing this, but RPGs are so, not a lot, I feel like I don't get RPG'd all that much anymore. Regardless, it's literally a roaming one by one. It's absolutely insane. So uh, we're gonna give you we're gonna give you a look at it, and I'm gonna explain what I'm doing here. So right off the bat, let me just do the whole ramp rush, then I'll kind of explain how you actually do it. All right, so that's that's what it looks like when you're doing it, and uh, sometimes it kind of just builds in random places, but that's not gonna really be a disadvantage like that. <laughs> That looks wild. See, it's it's so much protection for one little ramp rush. Obviously, people are going to say waste of mats because you know what it is, but you can use it at kind of late game when you have a ton of mats and there's like one or two people left and you know you're you're going to be fine on mats. So, uh that was one look at it. It varies all the time with actually what it builds because Getting like the the full timing down and doing everything the same every single layer is a little bit difficult, but basically, uh, actually I'm gonna do it again. I'm gonna see see what happens when I do it a second time. All right, that one was more clean, actually, and as you can tell. It's uh, it's a roaming one by one. It it really is, and it's terrifying. If I ever saw someone pushing me doing this, I would just immediately say psycho. Now, how I how I do this? Uh, of course, you have to have uh, a 2.0 building sensitivity, and I'd say having around a 7.5 regular sensitivity is pretty good for this. This is what my regular sensitivity settings are. So, uh, to learn it. I would I would recommend you you first do the my regular uh, four layer ramp rush video that I uploaded a couple months ago, where you build a ramp, uh, a wall, and then you do that that that. And if you want to learn how to do this and me go more in depth on that, I would just recommend going to that video. So four layer ramp rush, go check that out. Uh, it's not too hard to learn controller it's pretty easy to get the rhythm down actually so so you might not have too much of a problem with that maybe it is a little bit more difficult it's not it's not simple for sure but from there on basically you have to so you do this place this but this is all before spinning so do that place the ramp the floor the wall and then you're gonna want to spin all while jumping and in the air and then place that so you're basically gonna want to do that that and then spin and place the ramp all in the air so you have to do something like this and it it uh, is gonna be a little bit difficult at first to get the timing down for sure but that's uh, that's basically how you do it and the reason why this is like so unstoppable quote-unquote unstoppable is because if you're pushing this guy like say there's a guy in a one by one like right there and you you run up to him and then you start doing this um, you're gonna be pushing this guy and you're gonna have protection from all sides if this wants to build yeah you can't really get third party doing this uh, ramp push so that's why that's why I think it's so helpful it's like I said it's gonna it's a lot of mats it's only a waste of mats if you actually like don't have mats but if you have mats this is something you're gonna want to try out, and it's it's actually insane. Now it's only if you're willing to actually build regularly on this sensitivity, which honestly you could probably get used to because it's insanely fast, um, and it doesn't it doesn't take down your accuracy at all because you you switch out of build mode, 
And then, so look at this is my build mode sensitivity. And then my regular sensitivity is only this fast. And it's just perfect for aiming. So, literally, once you're, once you're done building stuff like this, you're absolutely fine and you can just shoot regularly and hopefully you guys can uh find some find some use of it you know i've actually i used it in game in my last video so in the maximum sensitivity video so if you want to check that out go check it out all right so here's a look we'll go regular speed okay messed up a little bit right there look at that okay now normally this wall right here would build I don't know what the issue was right there, but we'll take it back one more time just so you can see it again. All right, come on. You can do it. A little slow. Boom. Boom. Okay. Now, like I said, there might be someone that you're pushing over here. This is what it would look like pushing you. Yeah, you're not really shooting that thing out. All right, we found we found our victim. Yeah, just for the hell of it. Alright, why am I still invisible? Okay. There we go. Alright, well that wasn't of much use. I don't know where he went. Okay, well, we got him. Jesus, chill out, bro. Alright, here we go. This is gonna be a good one. Oh, he's got a... Okay. Let me just... Okay, perfect. It took him a few shots to break me down, so that's that's pretty dope. Let's uh, hit him with it. Alright, messed up a little bit, but... Let's chill. Back to 9-9. Nine, nine. Bunch of mats. Okay, good.
All right, here we go. Let's end it in style. There we are. In game, it's it's nice. I mean, quad launcher took a few shots to break me down. RPGs are just OP, and they can break down anything. So, what are you gonna say about that? But oh no, uses a lot of mats. Use it when you can. Use it when it's not using too many mats, or when you don't when you have a lot of mats. Um, but anyways, take care, everyone. See you.